Muscle Car Corner here, bringing you uh, some vehicles in the AC. I'm gonna go ahead and go through these. I'm just gonna do a walkthrough and uh, won't say anything about them, but just give you all a chance to look at uh, some of the vehicles inside this uh, air conditioned uh, arena, which is really nice. So, enjoy. Thirty-four, thirty-five. 
Now, this is one I need to talk about here. 428 Q code, Super Cobra Jet drag pack car. Super, it's got the drag pack, one of 3388 Cobra Jets built. 391 track pack. Sold new in Canada. It does have a Marty report on it. There's a Marty report right there from Kevin Marty. That was an awesome looking hood on this year. I tell you what, I just like these 69 Mach 1s. This color is just beautiful on this car. The stripes work. Black gut really looks nice. It's a C6 automatic car. I like the style of those seats. Seventy was a pinnacle year for Mustangs. I did like a seventy. It was probably my favorite out of the Mach ones. Really nice example. Here's a nice little 73 Cuda. Somebody put a 440 in it. That's a 74. It's got a little bit of uh, gritties in the motor. 73 was uh, about the last of a good year on the Cuda, I believe it was. Where'd it go to 74? I do not recall. It's sharp. It's a real deal car.
I like this Monte Carlo. It's the only one I've ever seen with a four speed before. Super cool. A gentleman's muscle car with a four speed. This car is beautiful and black, I tell you. Super rare car. Looks like a sleeper. I hit some of these yesterday. It's a really nice build on that RT. Let's take a look at this one for the Porsche fans. 91. I love driving these little cars. They're really fun. Yeah. 
Kind of like a launch edition because these things will launch. We're at V10. It's an amazing build. Just, just unbelievable. I'm about to come back to a video on this one by itself. This thing is amazing. Yeah, here's one I wanted to get a gander at. This 56 is amazing. 
under the lights, his color is just pops. Well, I'll tell you what, that thing works, everything, the color combo, this is over the top, huge, expensive build on this thing, just amazing, kudos to whoever built this. Mm. Now, Musk Car Corner bringing you one last one before I end this video, one of my favorites, 70, 440, six barrel. Cuda, Inviolet, Shaker Hood, N96. It's really nice. The Shaker looks to have the original paint on it. One of 902 produced. It is a V code car. There's a V in the VIN stating it's a six barrel car. It's a track pack, 354 Dana 60 up under the back of it. I like the way this car's optioned, it's nice. In violet. I always want to call it plum crazy purple. It's, but it's got a pistol grip with no console. These cars were made to go drag racing, man. And they came out with this six barrel. They hit the drag strip with slicks and headers and super stocked these cars. This one shows amazing. The body lines, the paint, everything is uh, up on the nine to 10 range for me on a scale one to 10. A lot of detail on this restoration. I like when they left the uh, shaker with the original paint. Keep anything you can original. Oh, it's a shaker. look at the fender tags real closely and take a look at what shape they're in do they have the original screws in them these things are important when you're looking at a Mopar well I'll tell you what I'm going to end the video with this uh, 7446 Cuda I just love this car boy ugh I sure would like to uh, have this one sitting in my stables one day. Most Car Corner signing out on a uh, nice long video. I'm going to do some of these longer videos with not as much talk and get these to you. Sure appreciate all my subscribers. Appreciate y'all. Most Car Corner signing out.